In today's video, I'm going to show you something that's truly amazing. It's a hidden gem in Excel. Have you ever been faced with a spreadsheet like this and you didn't know where to start? Perhaps your manager has told you to analyze the data, but how? Excel has a feature called Ideas, which will analyze your data, then will make suggestions. Before I jump into the content of this video, if you haven't already, then please click subscribe so you can see future videos like this. Okay, are you ready to see this hidden gem, this amazing feature? Then let's go. Before we start using the ideas feature, we first need to format this spreadsheet as a table. So if I go here and then go format as table, and today I'm gonna to go for the orange color and a bit of brightness, click OK. And that formats it as a table. I next go to home and then I click on ideas and Excel will now analyze my data and make suggestions. Here it's suggesting a pivot table, a chart. If I scroll down, it's more charts, a donut. <laughs> also at the very bottom there it says show all 30 results. So if I click there, it will expand the list and give me even more options. So really amazing that it can help you out, uses a bit of AI to analyze your data and then make the suggestions. Let's scroll to the top. So here's an example. Maybe I want to know what each department is spending on expenses. So what I can do is I can go here where it says which fields interest you the most. Deselect. And I'm interested in just the department and cost. and then press update and it will update the results for me. So I like this pivot table, so I'm gonna click insert pivot table and it inserts it for me. And if I click into the pivot table, I can still modify the details if I wanted to. You'll also notice at the bottom there, it's opened up a new tab called idea one. Let's go back to the form. So maybe I like to look at this uh, chart. So it's saying that uh, the department called maintenance is uh, spending the most. So if I click insert pivot chart, so that inserts it into a new sheet for me there at the bottom. So there it's called idea two. And if I click back to idea one, you can see I just got the pivot table on its own there. So every time I click on one of those ideas on the right hand side, it will open up a new sheet. Going back to the form, uh, something else to point out, uh, on my screen it's missing, but on yours you should have a field that says ask a question about your data. So this will allow you to ask Excel about your data and it will make suggestions based on your question. For example, you could type in how much are we spending on staff entertainment and it will produce the results for you. But the ideas feature is an amazing little feature. Like I said, you don't need to be an Excel expert and it just makes Excel so much easier, especially if you're stuck for ideas. Right, this is the video I want you to see next. And this is what YouTube wants you to see next. And if you haven't already, then please click subscribe. I will see you in the next video.